Hi folks, I'd like to say thank you to my new subscribers. I seem to have got a few today. I'm assuming that's you to Mr. Calder. So thank you, Dale. Um, I'm really looking forward to growing the seeds that he sent me. Um, what I'm planning to do with them is I'm going to try and grow at least 100 lights here on the CFLs and one in the window in the office and see how they go. It'd be really good if I could grow them in winter because I like fresh tomatoes, so that would be really cool. Uh, my, although this is a shop video, I've just done a little sign for my shop. Well, I will be doing updates on garden. There is a little bit of a clip at the back end at garden. It's, there's nothing happening. It's just, it's not even out of winter yet. We've had some warm days, but we could get more snow and it's still freezing at night so but i will be building a quail cage as well uh, for me quail uh, later on in the year so that might be interesting for some of you uh, i do hope you drop comments in the comment section and say hello uh, as i said this one is a shop one it's about a new sign i've made for my shop using electro um, etching and uh, i do have another channel if you're interested in gold prospecting i will put a link to that at the end as well but on this one i'll get on with it it's nice to be nice so decided to do something with this old wheel i'm going to make a sign out of it using that electrolysis method and stick it on my shed door first i'm going to sand it so that's that i've just blasted it with a random old little sander with about uh 220 i think it is 220 but i'm not going for more more than that i don't want shiny it doesn't matter but i'll clear coat it after uh this uh, blade incidentally I've got nothing that fits it it was something that came with the house I've just had to shut the door they're working next door um, all I've done is scribed a line round I'm, I've got it right eventually <laughs> so what I'll do I'll start from the best bit or half and half and I'm going to put my letters along that and I'm going to spray it and then uh, put peel letters off and do it as indented letters the opposite to what I did with, other, with that uh, knife and see how it turns out so what I've done here is uh, I've stuck these vinyls on and what I'm going to do is spray over it and peel them off and then it'll burn into it um, I'm also going to when I spray it I'm going to try and write welcome in there now I was told with my handwriting I should have been a doctor <laughs> so if it doesn't turn out right I'll spray it over again <laughs> that's that I told you I had doctor's handwriting <laughs> um, what I'm going to do now is wait for that to dry and I'll peel them stickers off and I should have a, like a relief sneak peek the wood chop for the, <laughs> for the tree stump right so that's dry and what I'll do is I'll try and do it and uh, we'll see what we get quite interesting that's going on me shop door so <laughs> bit of fun in it one or two had bled under a bit where I had tried to position them and tried to reposition them but I'll burn that and uh, we'll see what we get, see what it looks like. So, it didn't turn out all bad. I did get a bit of bleed under these, like I said. But um, I could, and I probably could have gone a bit more, a bit longer there, but I could uh, put paint on these now and clean it off. We'll just leave it as it is. I'm going to leave it as it is. If I ever get that uh, printer to work out properly, so I can iron them on, I'll do some prints out on the computer and do the other side. <laughs> so, but I'm going to go with that for a minute. It's all practice. I'm not quite sure how long I should do it and how long I shouldn't, but. I did that in real time, I only spent 10 minutes on it, but it's there forever, I won't do any handwriting, <laughs> it's like a five year old. <laughs> and there it is in situ, <laughs> I think I'll have to, what I'll do is I'll get a clear coat, 
and then so if I forget that lift thing working with um, with iron on, I might actually put a design on it and dip it and try dipping it. But yeah, it's all right. If you are new here, Dale's just sent me some uh, seeds, and this is my garden or some of it. Not a lot happening. I've got some broccoli and some kale in that planted in winter. They're not doing much. And I've got to tidy that up. I've got to build two new beds for that. That's something you might be interested in.